Well, Kathy Griffin released a video of herself posing with a bloody mannequin head made up to look like President Trump. Well, as comedy, it failed completely. Nobody thought it was funny. As performance art, it was lame, least creative stunt of the week by far. As a political statement, it didn't even make any sense. But it did have the effect of briefly making Griffin famous again. And, of course, that was likely the whole point. Today, Griffin elbowed her way back into the news cycle, holding a press conference with celebrity misery chaser Lisa Bloom. Here's part of what she said. Image that I participated in, that apology absolutely stands. I feel horrible. I have performed in war zones. The idea that this, you know, uh, made people think of this tragedy, to have been touched by this tragedy, is, is horrifying and it's horrible. Uh, trust me, if I could redo the whole thing, I would have had a blow up doll and no ketchup. I, I'm going to make fun of the president. And you know what? I'm going to make fun of him more now. More. I'm not afraid of Donald Trump. He's a bully. I've dealt with older white guys trying to keep me down my whole life, my whole career. I just wanted to say, you know, if you don't stand up, you get run over. And what's happening to me has never happened ever in the history of this great country, which is that a sitting president of the United States and his grown children and the first lady are personally, I feel, personally trying to ruin my life forever. This is America and you shouldn't have to die for it. The death threats that I'm getting are constant and they are detailed and they are serious and they are specific. And today it's me and tomorrow it could be you. I don't think I will have a career after this. Well, I think okay. he, I think he, I think he, I'm going to be honest, he broke me. He broke me. He broke me. And then I was like, no, this isn't right. It's just not right. There's a bunch of old white guys trying to silence me. And I'm just here to say that's wrong.